trademark at it. Coming up next, the six-man tag match. Keno Hao Nio versus Kazuyuki Fujita, Kendo Kashin, and Nosawa Rongai. Well, Mark, it's been a week since Keno successfully defended his GHC national title for the sixth time against Kendo Kashin, this time at Yokohama Budokan. Despite Kashin's trickery and tomfoolery, the Congo faction leader was angered to the point of pulling out two professional foot stomps and pinning Kashin after the second one. In his victory speech, he said the meaning of the pro wrestling is strength, and to be strong, you have to keep beating the strongest. And he went on to call out Kazuyuki Fujita, who was ringside with Nosawa Rongai. Actually, him calling out the challenger. Usually, it's the opposite way around. Yeah, Keno is supremely confident right now. The leader of Congo, as you said, Stuart, he's made six title defenses, and he's handpicked his opponent for his seventh title defense, which will be one week from now at the Kuroken Hall. Yeah, Fujita, however, never backs down. So it's on next week. Today, we can expect Fujita to stand his ground, but probably hold back a little bit. And Keno, probably, just to go brazenly in there and show his whole hand with unwavering confidence as always. Fujita is one scary individual. He's battered his way through Soya, Inoue, Taniguchi and Inamura. Fujita with the Sugiyura army have the upper hand on paper, I would say. Sugiyura Gun having won all Ultiman battles thus far. Right now in the ring, Hao, Neo and Keno. six-man tag match. Expect 110% aggression. Coming out first, Osawa Rongai, 44 years of age. He's a Chiba prefecture man with 25 years experience in the professional wrestling ring. He's held the UWA Trios Championship oh, with Manabu Soya and Nanseki Hanaka. And Soya is up. Uh, later on this card in Congo versus Noahism Clash of Titans. Alongside Nosawa, of course, Kendo Kashi and Fujita. Fujita, 50 years of age, 24 years of professional ring experience. Kendo Kashi, 52 years of age, an Aomori man with 28 years of experience as a professional wrestler. We saw some. Awfully dirty tactics last week, Mark. Yeah, you can see there, Keno is on red alert, not just for the presence of Fujita, but also been backed up by Kendo Kashin. Kashin's been able to push his buttons unlike anybody else. But still, the leader of Congo found another way to win six successful title defenses for that GHG national title that was introduced in 2019. It's second only to the GHG heavyweight title as a singles championship here in Pro Wrestling Noah. Kazuyuki Fujita in there, looking like a scud missile with cauliflower ears. He's held the RJPW Legend Championship for over a year, held IGF Championship, three times IWGP Champion. Cannot wait to see him challenging Ken O for the GHG national title on March 21st. We're starting things off here with the stay down. Straight into it. Keno has no time for Kendo Kashin anymore. He's dealt with him. And this man standing in front of him is his next challenge. Unwavering is Keno. Who's going to break first? Kazuyuki Fujita out here making coffee look nervous. Fujita went to war last year with Go Shiozaki <coughs> for 60 minutes. 30 minutes of that was a stare down. Now you see, Mark, what goes on here with these stare downs? There's a lot of psychology going on here. 
the blinks, the dilating of the pupils, any small telltale signs that there might be a weakness, an element of doubt. And if there's two men in this tag team match here tonight that have never had an element of doubt in their skills and strength, it's Keno and Fujita. Both men absolutely transfixed on one another. Crowd are anticipating their first engagement, their first contact. They're loving the tension in Fukuoka here. Keno is from the Tokushima area of Japan. Made his debut back in 2008. He's the third generation GHC national champion. Took it in April of last year. An incredibly well rounded and skilled wrestler and kicker, I would have to add. He has some tools that Fujita doesn't. But the same can be said of Kazuki Fujita. Neither man has moved, prepared to give up an inch. Still unwavering, it's like frozen time here in Fukuoka. Neither man wants to be the first to move to give that psychological advantage to their opponent. Kenu. I'm, I'm just surprised up. that wrong guy hasn't jumped in yet. Usually you'd see him in there just causing absolute chaos and confusion. Jumping into the middle of proceedings. There we go. Kenu. It's all. Moves in. They tie up. How does Keno deal with the power advantage that Fujita has? He'll have to employ those kicks, as you were saying, Stuart. That could be his strategy here. Try and bring the big man down off his feet. Fujita accepts the break. Ah, but he slaps him. Falls with a slap himself, the champion. Moves to the thigh kicks, chopping on the leg. Fujita. Going to work on the back of Keno. Turns him over, stays on him. Fujita's wrestling is something to behold. He's got a vice-like grip now. Trying to extend that around the neck. He's got the S grip there with the head and arm. Steps in. Oh! That looks nasty. Shoulders are down. Got the shoulders down. Can't see from this angle. Keno gets out. He was in some trouble for a moment there. A very wily champion he is. Overwhelming Keno with his brute force was Vegeta. Who gets the tag in? Maybe nobody. Fujita lets Kashin in. A little bit reluctant after his last experience with Keno one week ago. It's all mind games here, though. Neo and Kendo Kashin. Ah. Neo sends Kashin down early on there, and his partner, Hao, in with him. When these two get together, they are almost unstoppable. Lion Salt off the second rope. Still going to work on Kendo Kashin. The two magical men here, Neil and Hal. Kashin comes back. Oh! Ties him up with the head scissors on the ropes. Cranking his neck down over that top rope. The referee manages to stop him somehow. Kashin drags him out. Uh, on the apron and heads out to Keno. Referee's losing control of this one now. Action is spilled over to the outside. Neo on the barriers there. Kashin giving him some pain. Kazuki Fujita giving Keno a hard time here. This is very much the favourite domain of Sugera Gun. They love to take the fight to the outside. 
Keno okay, just so good at escaping from those chokeholds that Fujita has. Fujita's back in. Kashi is still, still up to some nasty work on the outside there. Making a beeline for the guardrails as always, Kendo Kashin. Fujita on the apron. Ah, he's got a chair and he slams it down onto Neo. The referee always gets distracted by Kendo Kashin. Who immediately protests his innocence. He's always got that tactic. 16. 17. Oh, guy holding back. How? Oh. 18. Oh, very close to the 20 count here. 19. Neil's back in. Just getting him back in on time there, Kendall Cashin. Slams down. Walks him up to the entrance curtain. What's he going to do with him? Slams him off the rails and leaves. <laughs> where's, where's he gone? Fujita getting back in. Will Kashin reappear with some hardware? Gone guy still battering How on the outside there. He's emerged with a chair. Oh, he's. That must have been one he brought with him in his Nine. luggage. He's wrapped him up. Ten. Oh no, he's tying him up. He's trying to tie him up with the feet yeah. and the neck. Now Nasawa's joining in chair. with the action Ten. as well. Five. Nobody in the ring right now. The count continues. 14. We're on 14. Somebody's got to get back in there. Nosawa says, run, run, run. Call it to Kashi to run. Kashi's like, what? 18. Kashi, you're going to have to do something. Eh, eh, he didn't get back in. No way. Kendo Kashi totally misread the situation. He's just too caught up in those nasty tactics. Took him two seconds to get 20 meters. Well, Samaronga is not happy with him. He says, I was telling you to get back in there. I was telling you to run to make the 20 count. For some, reason, for some reason, Karshin hesitated. He got halfway down the ramp, looked back towards the sour. He was gesturing him for him to get inside the ring, but he failed to break the count 20. So his team's disqualified. Ends up in a draw, but of course, Ken O and Fujita, they wanted to test each other a little bit more ahead of the title match next week. Not happy with the situation. He says it's, it's been a while since we came to Fukuoka. You can't leave it to finish here. He says we have to do this again. We have to do this again. This is no good. Ken O very unhappy with the situation and rightly so. Absolutely, fighting talk from the champion. He wants to settle it in the centre of the ring. Even the chaos that Mosala Rongai brings, it's still not as bad as the mistake Kendo Kashin has just made here today. Here we go. We're going to redo this one again. They go back to work. A to lot work. of anger, a lot of frustration coming out now. Kick after kick from Keno, the champion. Back to where we started. Keno and Fujita. Huge elbow from Fujita. Triples up. Oh, still on the outside. He's, he's not managed to get any action in the ring yet. Whoa. Slips out of the power bomb. 
Palm strikes, but he misses the last one. That is the sleeper. On the chalk sleeper. Will he tap out? Will he go to sleep? Can somebody come in to help? Or does he have a trick up his sleeve? Looking to cut off the oxygen supply. Keno in a very powerless position here. Keno usually very good at defending these. Struggling with the power, the size, the brute strength of Kazuyuki Fujita behind him right now. Slamming on that choke sleeper, trying to finish him off. How and long guy still on the outside of the ring. Ken, oh, can you get to the ropes? Can you squeeze free? Just managed to open his eyes there to see the distance to the ropes. He gets it just, only just. Come on, he says, get up. Massive elbow. Oh, the spinning heel kick from Ken O. Looks for the head this time. Misses with the first, catches him with the second. High kick from Ken O. His kicks are just fantastic. So sharp. And the way he goes from low to middle to high to keep his opponents guessing, just beautiful. That's wobbled and sent down for Jitta. He tags in Nosawa. Finally. Unusual to see him in the ring when he's the legal man. Aye, uh, he's... <laughs> if there's some these hand you do not want to shake, it's probably well, he's even getting down on a knee. Really? No. I don't know where Howe's been if he's not seen Nosawa before. Oh! Oh, he stays on him! Still on him! Howe's out. Take some foot stomps. Oh. Wrong guy off the ropes. oh, nice work there from Neil. See, when the two of these men are together, unstoppable. That's a lethal partnership, Howe and Neil. These two star junior heavyweights from Congo. Here's yes. the Congo pose. Here comes Kendo Karshin. Minus a chair this time. Diving elbow drops one after the other. Oh, this is looking nasty for Kashin. One after the other. Quick succession. The Congo members. So our tags in Fujita. Kashin rolls out to the apron. How and Neo looking back and forth. They're wondering how to deal with this monster they have in front of them. They go to work. Not enough, he's a beast. Fujita, such a man mountain, you can attack him from behind and he still doesn't go down. Okay, no capitalizing here. Oh! Huge kick. Okay, no, directing traffic. First he sends up Howe. Howe from the rafters! Splash of Howe. Oh, but just launched off by Fujita. Stuka splash. Fujita launches both men off his chest. They're like, seriously? What do we have to do to this guy? I think they both have to fly down on top of each other they to like make any kind of dent in Kazuki Fujita. They return to that tandem offense. Double lariat from Fujita. Keno goes to work with the kicks again. Whoa, folds him. Kazuki Fujita with a huge lariat in response. Soccer kicks him out. Straight to the heart of Keno, that one went. He now taking a knee. Powers up, power bomb. That looked horrible. Nosawa wisely drags Neo out to the ring. Oh, here's Kashin again with the plexiglass. This is the second time he's done this to Ken O. Nosawa has the camera. <laughs> Nosawa taking the shots. Fujita says, take a look at this one. Fujita says, catch this one. Oh, oh, oh. Devastating from Fujita. 
Oh, he gets the pen. Absolutely smashing him. Kazuyuki Fujita is aggression in human form. He's aggression personified. There he is. He's next up for Keno one week from now. The GHC National Championship at Kraken Hall. Sometimes you have to be careful what you wish for, Stuart. Kashin has already gave Fujita the GHC National Championship. One week from now, that will be on the line. March 21st, these two men will decide once and for all who gets to hold that illustrious belt. And Ken O has really given that belt a lot of name value in this last reign of his. Possibly this next week could be the most trying defense of Ken O's career. Very much looks like the most dangerous challenger he's faced today. The sheer power, the sheer force of Fujita could be what separates them next week. Kendo Kashin trying to thwart Ken O at every turn, adding to the frustration of the GHC national title holder Ken O. Ken O last to leave the ring here. Big congratulations to Fujita Kashin and Nosawa here today in Fukuoka. Ken O's going to have to go backstage and rethink his tactics ahead of next week's title defense. Yeah, he's got seven days to come up with a game plan. It was him who called out Fujita in Yokohama. Now he's just rethinking that now. He'll have to come up with a new strategy and start things over in one week's time. Stay with us, folks. The GHC Junior Heavyweight Championship up next. Prolesse Dolga High Shin Service. Vessel Universe. Samatama Prolesse Contents.月額900円でいつでもどこでも見放題。ここでしか見られない試合もプロレス見るならベッスルユニバース。俺だ。一番かっこいいプロレスここにあります。Noah! Yeah! Yeah! Noah! The Sand Hosel